You're responsible. That's right. That's right. That's right. Are you listening to me? Amen. The preacher that stand before you is responsible. Yes, Amen. His information that he give to you either is right, That's right. or wrong. Mm-hmm. If it's wrong, he's sending you to hell. That's, That's right. right. Did you hear me? That's right. You can buy him all the cars and buy him all the houses and buy him all the mink coats and let him walk around and look like a bear. That's right. <laughs> That's right. He can flash around his rings and his diamond watches. That don't matter. Right. Preacher, every word fall out of your mouth. That's right. It must be centered right. around God's word. That's Amen. right. That's right, sir. If anything come out of the preacher's mouth that contradicts God, then God is against him. That's Amen. right. And because the preachers know most of the church people don't read the Bible. That's right. Amen. That's it. Most of the church people are ignorant of the Bible. So when Jerry Curl Head Reb get up snorking and grunting like a pig in slop, that's right, that's right, preaching like he have asthma, that's right, breathing hard, and that's it, that's it, sir. Am I right? <laughs> oh yes. So for years, for years we were ignorant, deaf and dumb. Oh yes. And we didn't know what preaching was. That's right. For years we didn't even know what a preacher was. That's right. We thought a preacher was someone who rode around a big black Cadillac uh-huh. with the backward collar on. That's right. And a cross round his neck. That's right, sir. Coming at your mama house eating her out of chicken and potato salad. That's it, That's it, sir. That was it. Do you understand? That was it. <laughs> That's what we thought what a preacher was. That's right. That's right. Until our mind is programmed so bad, we think every building that got a cross in a steeple right. is a house of God. No. No, no. That's like the mafia have organized crime. Uh-huh. They use a pizza shop as a front, uh-huh. but in the back of all that dough is a prostitution ring. Yeah. <laughs> they use a cleanness as a front, Amen. but in the back of all those starch shirts, there is a gambling racket going on. So that's the way churches have become. Amen. The steeple and the cross have become nothing more than a front. front is right. So they use church and masquerade behind religion Uh to try to make you think God is on our side, even though we know we're wrong. That's That's right. right. Amen. We are justified in our wickedness in the name of God. Mm -hmm. So look at what the preachers say is all right to do now. Mm -hmm. In church now, you can get all the wives you want. That's That's true. In church now, you can get all the husbands you want. That's right. Amen. In church now, the preacher can sleep with the deacon. That's right. That's right. That's right. This is what church became now. That's right. That's right. Oh, yeah. In church now, you can stand in front of the steeple and get your last few drags on your cigarette <laughs> before you go in with the trustee. That's right. Amen. That's right. This is what church has become. Amen. Half naked women. Yes. Half naked men. That's right. Oh yeah. It is nothing more than a disgrace. That's right. That's right. So, brothers and sisters, the Lord is tired of it. Oh, yeah. This belief that God is not looking at your outward, He's looking at your heart. Yeah. Is a lie. That's right. Amen. For when a person's heart get right within, the outer man and the outer woman falls in place. That's right. That's right. Yes, sir. Talk to me. Yes, sir. It is no such thing. You are Christian based upon your religious convictions. Amen. God don't give two cents about our personal views about him. That's right. God say my thought is not your thought. That's right. My way That's is right. not your, your way. That's right. Sir. So we're not here to bring Pastor Jennings way. Who am I? That's right. I'm not here to bring you my way. I'm not here to bring you Dan the man's way. 
I'm not here to bring you Williams way. They don't have no way. No, We're here to bring you God's way. That's right. That's right. Amen. And the reason why I want to convey that to you, just in case any of you get mad uh -huh. and get upset, mm -hmm. you can't say that Geno Jennings make me sick. <laughs> because I'm going to point you to the Bible. That's right. So that way, if you leave out cussing and mad and have your Bible, Tell the truth. That's right. look at your Bible and cuss it out. That's right. Amen. Fuss with it. That's right. How in the world can you be so much of a Christian didn't get upset over the very book you carry? That's, That's right. right. That's it. That's it. That's it. That was it. How can you go to church so much and then get upset over the very book that got your little family name on it? That's Amen. right. The Bible you got in the dashboard in your car. Mm -hmm. You know why folks get upset? Because truly, they don't believe it. That's right. And there's something in that Bible they don't want to obey. That's right. The scriptures are not designed to please us. That's right. The scriptures are not designed to come down to our standard of living. That's right. God have a standard. Yes, sir. You got to come up to God's standard. That's right. God's Amen. standard is not coming down to none of us. That's right. Amen. God ain't making no changes. Yes, sir. We got to make all the changes that God demands. Amen. All right. Are you listening? Beautiful. Beautiful. All right, let's get these letters out the way quick. And then I arm wrestle Chester. Amen. <laughs> All right, Dan, come on, brother. An email says, praise the Lord, saints. My yes. name is Tyrone Turner, an elder of the Pentecostal Power Church of the Apostles' Doctrine, mm -hmm. Milwaukee, Wisconsin. I had the pleasure of hearing Pastor Jennings teach the word of God at a friend's house. And I tell you, my heart was made glad. Finally, someone who has been blessed to have a broadcast and teaching and preaching what they're claiming on the broadcast. Repenting of sins and being baptized in the name of Jesus Christ for the remission of those sins and waiting on God to be filled with the Holy Ghost. And not only that, but must live a clean and a holy life. I want to say I thank God for you and keep holding up the blood stained banner. This is Elder Tyrone Turner, Milwaukee, Wisconsin. All right, Wisconsin. Thank you for that wonderful letter. Next letter. Dear Pastor Jennings. My husband and I have been watching your broadcast faithfully for a couple of months now mm -hmm. and really have been blessed. We appreciate your preaching the word of God without compromising. We have a concern about an issue that has arisen close to us. All right. We have just discovered that our pastor is a Mason. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we, <Yes>. are, <laughs> we are disturbed by this and would like your opinion about people who are supposedly serving and preaching the true and living word of God being in the Mason organization. <laughs> So far in your broadcast, we have not heard Masons, Masons discussed. Yes, I discussed Masons before, but I, I, I do it again. Amen. Amen. All right, uh, let's dive into this now. And that goes for if I got any light carriers here. That's right. That's right. If I got any Masons here. Amen. Or Eastern stars, which are fallen stars. Uh -huh. <laughs> Band of Masons is of the devil. Amen. That's right. That's right, sir. Teach it, brother. Jesus said, in secret have I said nothing. Amen. That's right. The Masonic order claimed that being a Mason is delight. Mm -hmm. What is Masonry? Amen. I'm not talking about the organization or the secret sorority, but naturally, what is Masonry? Masonry naturally is him or her who mastered the craft and cutting stone. That's right. That's right. That's to make a stone fit uh -huh. <laughs> in the process of building a building. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Are you listening? Go ahead. Jesus called himself yes. the stone. That's right. Cornerstone. The chief cornerstone. That's right. Not a mason. No, no. no. But he is the chief cornerstone. Mm -hmm. Meaning the main stone that everything supposed to be built around. Wonderful. Jesus saith unto them. Listen. In Matthew chapter 21 and at verse 42. Follow me. East, uh, you that's in the uh, Prince Lodge and Scottish, Scottish Rites. Amen. The Freemasonries and the non-Freemasons. That's right. Listen. Matthew 21 and verse 42. Follow me. Jesus saith unto them, Did you never read in the scriptures? Did you read in the scriptures? The stone. The stone. Which the builders rejected. Which the builders rejected. The same, the is, become, same is become the head of the corner. Now, mm -hmm. the reason why I say the Masonic order is of the devil, 
You may build hospitals and give scholarships to colleges. That's all well and good, but it ain't good enough. That's right. A scholarship don't give you eternal life. That's Amen. Right. A hospital don't give you eternal life. That's right. We talk about having a belief that will connect you to God. That's it. This is what we're talking about. That's right. Now, Masonic order, you say that you have the light. Well, if I'm in the light and I got a brother in the dark. Amen. According to the belief of the Masonic order, I can't share the light with my brother. That's right. Because I take a vow of secrecy. That's right. Amen. And I'm not allowed to reveal the crafts mm -hmm. and the arts. Mm -hmm. I'm even initiated. That's right. If I reveal those secrets, then I have broken the vow. I agreed to have, I believe, my tongue snatched out mm -hmm. and my heart cut out. Mm -hmm. Amen. If I tell people how to become a mason, right. well, if you are the light, mm -hmm. then you should be telling everybody That's right. how to become a mason. Right. That's right. Walk in the light. Because if you walk in the light, you know, the scripture says as he is in the light, That's we right. have fellowship. That's right. That's right. So being that you took an oath mm -hmm. of secrecy and won't tell. I didn't take no oath. That's right. That's right. And I'm going to tell. That's Amen. right. Amen. <laughs> the way you become a mason, number one, they use marbles. Mm -hmm. Imagine that. You need toys to get to God. That's right. Lord. That's something. White marbles and one black marble. Mm -hmm. That's right. If the black marble fall on you, is what is called blackballed. Mm -hmm. Can't be a mason. Mm -hmm. But if the white marbles fall on you, you are accepted. You are told you must bring food <laughs> for the goat. A religion mm -hmm. based upon toys and animals and lies. That's right. That's right. And then after you're told you got to bring food to feed a goat, which is no goat to feed. That's right. That's greedy men, That's right. There's a bunch of greedy men. That's right. That's right. <laughs> you're blindfold. That's it. And then when you are blindfold, mm -hmm. <laughs> I thank God for television. <laughs> Some of you matrons may get upset. Uh -huh. And you know I, I do want you to do something about it. <laughs> <laughs> you are blindfold. Then your shirt is torn Lord. over your heart. Mm -hmm. And one of your pants legs is rolled up. During that process, a bunch of sick men run around you making sick noises. Amen. Some participate in hitting you with little items. That's right, sir. That's it. Scare you up. Right. That's right, sir. Something. God's way don't blindfold you. Oh, no. It come to pull blindness off of you. That's right. That's right. That's it, Pops. God's way is not right. rending your shirt. Yeah, no. The prophet Joel says, right. rent your heart, tear the heart, That's and right. not the garment. That's right. Torn clothes doesn't mean nothing. That's right. No. Amen. So they have all these secrets initiation. Mm -hmm. Then when you get to a certain area in masonry, yeah. you denounce the Bible. Mm -hmm. And you pick up the Quran. Amen. Now, if this secret, mm -hmm. I had a mason come, I believe, from Delaware to meet with me. He told me in my office, I enjoy your program, but I just want to straighten you out. <laughs> We're not a religion. We are a secret organization, like a secret so society, right. a sorority. Right. It's a, so a uh, sorority is supposed to be, you know, the elite. Mm -hmm. Well, the scripture tells me you're nothing but dust. Yes, that's right. right. What's so elite about dust? That's right. Then the Masonic order have what is called the fun house. Mm -hmm. <laughs> to my masons that may be sitting here, right. why don't you tell your wife about the fun house? Amen. <laughs> and to the wives that have husbands as masons, mm -hmm. when you after you leave. And when you get in the car, Western. you know how you can do. That's right. <laughs> Clam down his ear. Ask him, what is this fun house this? 
Man, talk them out. Uh-huh. It lives up to the name. Right, right sir. They swap women. My right. Lord. They have a big orgy. My right. Lord. They play with one another. That's Amen. Right. Tell the truth. Sir. The Masonic order is of hell. That's right. And if the head of the order say I'm wrong, well, we can rock with the scriptures. That's Amen. Right. Oh yeah. That's right. No religion Go right. is going to use the Bible as a front That's right. because you build hospitals. So what? That's right. Heaven and earth is going to pass away. That's right. That's right. Amen. That's right, sir. Every Amen. hospital you build that's is right. going to pass away. That's, that's right. right. That's right. That's right. Have the truth. No one that's a mason that's is right. in the light. Amen. Your little ring is not a light. That's, that's right. right. Amen. Your lion's call. Go ahead. That's right, sir. To pull them from the dead. That's right. Hold a hand like Spock. That's right. <laughs> you know? That's right. Master the grip. Amen. That's right. Pull them up. Go ahead. It takes God to pull us from the dead. Amen. That's right. That's right. God Himself. God Himself. Right, Amen. It's not a mason living that's from the dead. Amen. Because you're still covered in your dirt, in your sin, in your filth, in your wickedness under the heading of God. God. That's, that's right. right. Amen. So if you got a preacher Amen. who's a mason, that's right. you got a false prophet. That's right. You want to know whether he's a mason or not? Look on the back of his car and look at his little stickers. That's right. Amen. <laughs> Let you know, sir. You got your little sword and your little light and your little shield. Oh, that's rubbish. rubbish. That's I right. got a sword. That's right. It's the book. That's right. I got a shield. That's right. It's my faith in God. Go ahead. That's right. Amen. That's uh, beautiful. Go ahead. And I take my sword and my shield Amen. and cut the world. That's, that's right. right. And I do it with the book. That's right. Amen. Beautiful, sir. That's right. So if you are Mason, Amen. And you have a desire to be saved and right. That's right. Mm -hmm. You gotta give that junk up. That's, That's right. right. Amen. That's, That's right. right. You gotta come out of it. Come out of it. Come out from the How about old Pastor Jennings there kill me? You gonna die anyway. That's right. Amen. Fear not. Yes, That's right. Fear not to come back and destroy the body. That's it. After what he can't do no more. That's right. But rather fear him that after destroying both body and soul That's could right. cast them both into hell. Yes. Jesus said, I said, fear him. That's right. That's right. Amen. Yes, sir. That's right. Huh? That's it, Amen. Amen. Make it with your little ring going. Come on, you got a light. I have not spoken in secret. Listen. In Isaiah Amen. chapter 45 and verse 19. Listen at what God says. I have not spoken in secret. In a dark place of the earth. <laughs> That's right. Amen. The Lord our God says, I haven't spoken in secret. In a Amen. dark place in of the earth. In a dark place of the earth. I said not unto the seed of Jacob, seek ye me in vain. You see this? I, the Lord, speak I, righteousness. I, the Lord, speak righteousness. I declare things. I declare That's things. That are right. That's, That's right. What you say. God declares things that are right. That are right. Why are you a mason? Amen. That God tell you to be a mason? Mm. May God tell you to get blindfolded and tied up and shirt ripped to come to him? No, no. If you want to come to God, you must come to him on the order of scripture. That's right. Yes, sir. Not according to your feelings. That's right. Amen. So yes. Amen. If you are Mason, mm -hmm. you're being deceived. That's right. Amen. Oh yeah. And you're in a weak lodge. Amen. Amen. That's right. And the one that stand ahead of you is a weak false prophet. That's, That's right. right. That's plain. That's plain. Now bring me your light. That's Amen. Right. You ought to send a basket around and collect their rings. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's it, prophet. Amen. That's it. All right, next letter. Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. Listen. I recently read your literature online regarding women preachers. Mm -hmm. I do not exactly agree with what you said in that piece. You contradicted your own point during the letter. Really? In Galatians 3.28, it says that neither male nor female, for yes. we all are one in Christ Jesus. Uh -huh. To me, that's right there says that it doesn't matter if you're a man or a woman because we are all equal in Jesus Christ. Mm -hmm. It also says in John 17 that God's prayer was to make us all one. I love it when people write me and give me scripture. <laughs> you know, have you ever met a person that do a lot of talking and they don't know what they're talking about? That's right. A lot of sincere people that's write true. me and they mean well. That's true. That's right. And they give me a lot of scripture. That's right. But then they can't explain what they give. That's right. Amen. Listen. It also says in John 17 that God's 
prayer was to make us one. Yeah. To me, this is saying that God is wanting us to all strive for the one goal, and that is to preach the word of God. Mm. So what does it matter if a woman is, one, is a preacher or a man? Mm -hmm. It shouldn't matter. It isn't a man thing or a woman thing. It is a Jesus thing. Mm -hmm. My pastor, who is a male, spoke on the subject of Mary going to preach the word. Mm. Mm. And she did preach. What exactly is preaching? Isn't that sharing the good news of God? Isn't that what Mary did? I believe she went and shared with people of his resurrection. To me, that would be preaching, would it not? No. <laughs> That's right. No. That's no, it's not. No, it's That's not. right. No, it's preach not. it. Preach it. No, I mean, not. a man can stagger out the bar. <laughs> Drunk as a fish. That's right. And start talking about the Bible. That's, That's right. right. You gonna tell me he's preaching? That's it. No, he's Amen. not. Sir. No. You got the wrong concept of preaching. That's right. Again, most folk pre think preaching is just someone quoting scriptures. That's right. That's not preaching. That's not preaching. No, no. Jesus said, the spirit of the Lord God is upon Amen. me and hath anointed okay. me. To to preach. Preach. Don't tell me to That's right. It, the man is not the preacher. God must get in the man and then utilize the man. Okay. Utilize That's the clay. Okay. That's the anointing That's God it. in the man. Amen. Can a woman preach? No. No, no. Never, no. Never, sir. No. Did God ever call one? No. 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 That's right. Will he ever call one? No. 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 Can Amen. you prove it? Get ready to right Amen. now. Isaiah chapter 3. Amen. That's right. Yes, getting ready to. Amen. Just in case I got any sincere young sisters here right. who are becoming victims of these non-denominational churches, these so-called evangelistic churches that have you up there screaming and harm at the top of your lungs. That's right. Now I'm going to pick up every scripture the writer has. That's right. And then we're going to break it down. Amen. That's right. I don't want them to think I'm going to dodge this scripture no, because no. that's my life. That's <laughs> right. Eh? That's you right. understand? That's right. All right, let's get Galatia. Let's break it down and take it apart and put it back together with Bible. In Galatians chapter 3 and at verse 28. Follow me. You that here. Uh -huh. Galatia chapter 3. Verse 28. This is the scripture that most people use to try to justify women can preach. Uh -huh. Imagine that grown men. A, a, man, a woman that's a real woman. She don't want to be head of her own man. No. No. no, no. She don't want no man she can boss around. No, sir. That's right. Out of place. Grab him by the collar. That's right. That's right. <laughs> and cry out to him. That's right. She want a man that's going to protect her. That's it. Amen. That's it, Pops. If someone break in the house, mm. she don't want no man. You go see who it is. <laughs> That's right. Am I right, women? Hey, Amen. That's it. You don't want no man acting more feminine than you are. No way. Women preachers have never been a scriptural thing. No. It's a church organization thing. That's right. right. That's the difference. That's Amen. right. Church organization and scripture is different. That's Amen. Right. Listen. In Galatians chapter 3 and verse 28. Follow me. There is neither Jew nor Greek. Oh, listen at this. There's neither Jew or Greek. There is neither bond nor free. Bond or free. There is neither male nor female. Male or female. For ye are all one in Christ Jesus. No, we are all preachers in Christ Jesus. Ye are all one. One in Christ Jesus. No, we are preachers in Christ Jesus. We are all one in Christ Jesus. Preachers in Christ Jesus. One in Christ Jesus. I, did I say, did I say preachers in Christ Jesus? No, no. Why did you add? That's right. The Bible said in Revelation 22, 18, I testified unto every, unto every man that heareth the words of the prophecy of this book. Right. If any man shall Amen. add unto these things, mm -hmm. God shall add unto him the plagues that are written in the book. And if any man shall take away from these things, God shall take away from his part out of the book of life and from the holy city mm -hmm. and from the things that are written in the book. Say what the Bible said. That's, That's right. right. And you say. Don't add. That's, That's right. right. When the Bible said neither male or female, mm -hmm. But we're all one in Christ Jesus. Mm -hmm. That means God doesn't have no respective person That's right. towards members of the human family of those that want to come to him, serve him, bow to him, submit to him, obey him. That's, That's right. right. That's but right. God don't make preachers out of everything. No way. No, 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 sir. no way, sir. No way. Before Jesus walked earth, he sent prophets. That's right. Didn't he do it? Yes, Amen. Oh, yeah. We believe that women can prophesy. Oh, yeah. Amen. Certainly. Because in the scriptures, they done it. That's right. That's right. But prophesying is not preaching. That's, that's right. right. Prophesying is the foretelling of events that's going to come. That's Amen. Right. God may move on a woman mm -hmm. to prophesy. Mm -hmm. Chester's going to be destroyed in seven days. That's right. Somebody may run to her. How do you know? Well, God didn't give her the interpretation. That's right. Or to give her the explanation. That's right. Just move on her to prophesy. That's it. Tell what's coming. Amen. The prophet mm -hmm. who's a preacher right. 
Not only do God give him ability to prophesy, that's right. then he come back to explain why that's right. and give the meaning of the prophecy. That's right. Break it down Amen. and see how it connects that's with it. the present book of prophecy. That's right. Deborah that's right. was a prophetess, Amen. but who did she preach to? That's that's right. Philip was an evangelist and had four daughters right. that was prophetess, that's right. but who did they preach they to? That's right. Amen. You say Mary preached? That's one of them homemade scriptures. That's right. That's right. They ain't written nowhere. Uh -huh. Jesus rose from the dead uh -huh. the third day. Beautiful. Told Mary, tell my disciples and Peter to meet me in Galilee. That's right. Is that any different than if I arise and arrive in Chester and see Brother Dunstan's wife, Sister Dunstan? And I say, sister, tell my brothers to meet me over there at the plaza about three o'clock. That's right. That's right. Is she preaching? No, no way. She's not coming over here, brothers. <laughs> <laughs> brothers. <laughs> Pastor Jennings said, <laughs> meet him. Amen. Talk to me. Amen. That's right. That's right. That's right. Amen. That must be good, sir. Make it plain, sir. Not doing that. No, she's not. Amen. No, she's not. Amen. Go ahead. <laughs> Go ahead. That's right. The woman at the well, she testified uh -huh. of Jesus' goodness. Mm -hmm. That's right. And the men of Samaria believed. Mm -hmm. Testify simply means to bear witness of. That's right. If God done something for any woman in the world, mm -hmm. she got the right to tell folk what God done for her. That's but right. that's not preaching. That's, preaching. that's right. That's right. Preaching is one in the spirit. By the spirit is a Bible interpreter. That's right. Good work. Able to break down that's scripture. Wonderful. Go to the Old Testament. That's Go to the New. That's make it. the scripture harmonize Amen. and don't allow Jeremiah to contradict Paul. That's, that's right. right. Amen. That's right. Don't allow Isaiah to contradict Peter. That's right. Amen. Harmony, sir. Wonderful, sir. Go ahead. Amen. Now, if a woman can preach. Mm. According to the Bible, she's not to enter into water in the time of her purification. That's right. That's right, sir. That's right. Now, if I need to be baptized, That's right. mm -hmm. and her flowers is upon her, That's right. how can she baptize me? That's Amen. Right. That's right. Can't be instant. If she's in hospital, That's right. birthing a child, That's right. That's right. she going to take a break from being in travail uh -huh. to save me? No. No way. The Bible have women in their prospective place. Right. Just like the Bible have men in their prospective place. You false churches have deaconess. That's, That's right. right. Women That's deacons. Right. The Bible ain't never had them. Never. Amen. You false churches have women bishops. That's right. The Bible ain't never had them. That's right. You weak men are assistant pastors to your loud mouth wife. That's Amen. Right. The Bible ain't never had them. Go ahead. That's it. Go ahead. Not in there, sir. That's it. Amen. Go ahead, you weak men Go sit ahead. in these churches. That's, That's right. right. And the woman is your overseer. That's but right. the Bible says the head every of woman, every woman, woman is the man. That's right. That's right. Man. That's, right. That's, right. That's right. Amen. Now tell me, how are you the head at home? Mm -hmm. And you drop to the tail in church. Yeah. That's uh -huh. right. How is that? How is that? Amen. 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 Go ahead. You see the lies? That's right, sir. That these churches done told you? Yeah, amen. That's it. You don't have women bishops in the Bible. No, sir. Yeah, no. You have them in false churches. That's right. That's right. You don't have women uh, elders and women apostles and women deacons in the scriptures. That's right. You have them in devil built churches. That's amen. That's it. The amen. God of heaven teach the women in First Peter chapter three. Mm -hmm. And beginning at verse 3. First Peter right. chapter 3 and verse 3. Teaches the women. Whose adorning let it not be that Let it not adorning. be the outward adorning. Of plaiting the hair. And tell the women not to plait your hair. And of wearing of gold. And tell them not to be all in gold. Or of putting on of apparel. And tell them not, what it says, of putting on their apparel, not to dress like the world, like sinners, That's half right. naked. That's, That's right. The split from your ankle all the way up to your hip. That's right. Amen. <laughs> That's right, that's a right. dress about this long that's right. and a blouse about that big. That's right. That's right. That's right. Go ahead. Amen. Ankle chain wearing Christians. That's right. Amen. You're not a hold on where the label is one. That's, that's right. right. That's right. Am I right? That's Amen. right. Go ahead. Go ahead. What's wrong with the way God made you? That's right. Amen. 
That's it, sir. Beautiful. Satan, through the usage of the media, uh -huh. make you hate yourself. That's, That's right. right. Make you hate the way you look. Amen. Make you hate the texture of your hair. Uh -huh. Amen. Even make you hate the grain or the color of your skin. That's true. Right. So you sit and bleach your skin. That's right. To get it whiter. That's right. And my white sister is so busy in a tanning booth That's to right. get darker. Amen. Never satisfied. You're never satisfied. That's right. You go buy wigs. Yep. Can't even match your color right. That's right. Amen. You buy hair extensions. Mm -hmm. That's right. Look like long shoelaces. That's right. And walk around with a hair full of spaghetti. That's, That's right. right. What's wrong with the way God made you? That's right. Go ahead. 70, 80 year old women. Go ahead. Older to be my grandmother. Go ahead. Wanna wear wigs. Amen. Wanna dye your hair. Right. Wanna arch your eyebrows. Right. Wanna wear high spike heels right. and look like a grand hoe. That's Go right. ahead. That's right, sir. Go ahead. Preach it. Vomit. But yet these churches don't see nothing wrong with it. No, no. The reason why they don't see nothing because they're so busy worrying about losing numbers. That's right. You don't worry about losing numbers. That's Amen. Right. You worry about losing your soul. That's right. I tell you the truth if I die tonight. Amen. Amen. That's right. Are you listening to me? Amen. Go ahead. That's right. Go ahead. Listen to what the book says. But Amen. let it be the hidden man of let the heart. Let it be the hidden man of the heart. In that which is not corrupted. The hidden man is all God. There's That's no right. corruptness in God. Uh, Even the ornament. Even the ornament of a meek and quiet spirit and quiet yes, spirit which is in the sight of God of great price yes, sir. holy women don't need to be out in the street half naked no, no. why when the summertime hit you hit you can see church people mm -hmm. going to church with their back all out that's right little halter on that's right mm -hmm. Up on the choir with passion marks descending lower and lower. That's right. Go ahead. Breasts yeah. hanging out and babies crying because they don't know who their mama is. That's right. That's right. That's it. Go ahead. That's it. You turn BET on. Mm -hmm. right. They're like a bunch of Christian faggots and hoes. That's right. Amen. That's it, sir. Amen. Amen. Half naked women just clapping. That's right. That's Everything right. jumping. That's right. That's right. Everything clapping. Sir. And the men up clapping. That's right. <laughs> That's it, Father. Go ahead. That's it. Go ahead. Am I right, I said? Amen. Amen. That's up. Supposed to be in the spirit. That's Go right. ahead. Supposed to be, sir. Go ahead. You understand? That's right. That's right. This is what church have become. Amen. Amen. What make people look at us so strange? It's the truth. Because they see in here mm -hmm. what they don't normally see in here, but what a lot of folks subconsciously think. That's right. They be like, I know church ain't supposed to be like this. That's, That's right. right. I know church ain't got a business acting like this. Amen. That's right, sir. And that's why so many folk can equate themselves with our program. That's it. Mm -hmm. We speak the conscience of the people. That's right. That's right. What they think God make us preach. That's right. That's right. Because it is God's divine law. That's Amen. Right. It is no, listen, if the Bible says you are a new creature, new creature. Amen. then how can we have Christian rap? Please tell me. That's right. That's it. Christian that's right. rap? Amen. Amen. If the scripture teaches us mm -hmm. we are the light of the world, That's it. Mm -hmm. that means the world look at us uh -huh. and in us supposed to be the pattern That's or right. the behavior of right. heaven. That's, That's right. right. That's right. But today you can't see the behavior of God no. in church. No, no. You see hell That's Amen. Right. in church. That's, That's right. right. That's Amen. right. That's why in church they want to be just like the world. That's right. Mm -hmm. oh, the yeah. world come with rap. Oh, yeah. So-called Christians come with rap. Oh, yeah. That's right. Amen. The world come with bebop. So-called Christians come with bebop. That's right. Amen. The world want to wear their wrangler prison clothes. Uh -huh. <laughs> so brothers in church got their jeans hanging down. That's right. That's right. With a wrangler jacket long too big. That's mm -hmm. right. Corn, corn rolls in their hair. Yeah. Amen. Earring in each ear. Yes. Right. And somebody use a witness for Jesus. That's right. Where's your change? That's Amen. Right. Now, out of ignorance, we would say, well, my change is in the heart. Mm -hmm. Anytime a man or woman heart change, then that temple change. That's, That's right. right. Your body is the temple of the living God. That's right. And God don't permit you or I to do anything right. with our body. That's, That's right. right. Are you listening to me? That's Therefore, right. if any the man. The scripture says you are not your own. Not your own. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. Then who do you belong to? That's, That's right. right. Amen. Beautiful, sir. Go ahead. If you're Amen. not your own. Amen. And you say you belong to Christ. Amen. Amen. What do Christ and a cigarette got in common? That's, That's right. right. What do Christ and that woman you living with got in common? That's right. That's not your wife. Amen. What do Christ and being a faggot got in common? That's Go right. ahead. Amen. What do Christ and being a lesbian got in common? That's right. Amen. Go ahead. Are you listening to me? Go ahead. What does Christ That's right. and racism That's right. got in common? That's right. Amen. 
black folk feel important because a white brother walk in the church. Uh -huh. Right? Yeah. Ignorance, they say, oh, we're doing something now. That's right. <laughs> we're doing something. That's right. Ooh, we had a white, a white brother come in. Amen. We're doing something, fool. That's, That's right. right. That's, That's right. right. Bible says you're fool and slow of heart. Slow of heart. That's, right. That's right. Amen. Black brother walk in an all white church. Oh, God. They clinch their pocketbooks. That's right. Amen. That's right. Think they're about to be robbed. Amen. That's right. Preaching a mass and alarm up under the podium. That's, That's right. right. Security. That's right. Go ahead. Go ahead. Am I right, I said? Go ahead. Speak the country, sir. Wonderful. Go ahead. Beautiful, sir. Amen. When you say that you are a child of God, Amen. that means change is starting to take place. That's right. Let's finish up these women preachers. Give me the prophet Isaiah, which mm -hmm. is Isaiah. In Isaiah chapter 3 and at verse 12. Just in case I got any sisters here mm -hmm. who may be little teeny weeny evangelists. Amen. <laughs> may the Almighty have mercy upon your heart. And in case I got any men here That's right. who's sitting in a movement like PAW. Uh -huh. Pentecost Assemblies of the World. And they got the right name because they are of the world. That's oh, right. yeah. UPC. That's right. mm -hmm. Who believe in women preachers Amen. and remarriage and divorce? Remarriage Can you imagine sitting looking at a preacher who got about three wives? That's right, my lord. What time did that man got to tell you about the crucifixion? Amen. He's busy. That's right. <laughs> yes, sir. But the people have became so comfortable. That's right. Their attitude is well. It doesn't matter because you got three wives. Everybody doing it now. That's right. Mm -hmm. Everybody doing it now. Well. Look, the way to be saved is within. That's right. That's right. Within. That's right. You know, you serve Jesus your way. I serve him mine. He don't got to do all that. It's within. Amen. You believe that lie. Mm -hmm. What you got within is the way you act without. Is right. the devil in you? You are gonna act like the devil without? That's, That's right. right. Amen. That's right. Yes, sir. Are you getting what I'm telling you? Amen. Amen. So imagine being in the church. That allow you to remarry and divorce, and we're gonna deal with that. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Just in case some of you here with your second meat. Right. That's right. You know, you don't know where your chicken is, but you got your pork chop. That's right. That's right. I don't care how old you are either. That's right. Amen. Old man. Old man. You've been living with that woman for thirty years, and your first wife's still living. That's right. You can be a deacon or a preacher. Mm -hmm. You are living in adultery. That's right. And you're a false prophet. That's right. That's right. That's it. Huh? That's, That's right. right. We're going to prove this. Oh, yeah. Prove it. That's right. Listen. Yes, sir. In Isaiah chapter 3, beginning in verse 12. Let's finish getting this woman preacher epidemic out. Isaiah chapter 3 and verse 12. Yes. As for my people, children are their oppressed. As for my people, children are their oppressed. And women. And what? Women. Who don't know what a woman is? Raise your hand. <laughs> we doing all right? Amen. Listen. And women rule over them. How did the prophet feel about women ruling over them? Oh, my people. Brothers, how did the prophet feel about women ruling over them? Oh, my people. How did he feel? Oh, my people. How did he feel? Oh, my people. How did he feel? Oh, my people. Oh, my people. Yes, sir. Amen. Have you noticed the churches don't feel the same way? No, they don't. You got the men sitting out there mm -hmm. boosting the woman preacher on, acting like a woman. Go ahead, mother. That's right. And if you give these men... Hanging around a woman right. too long. Amen. They're going to pick up her character. That's right. Amen. That's why you can see them in the church supposed to be in the Holy Ghost. That's right. Men. That's my right. Lord. That's it. That's it. <laughs> These are men. That's right. They don't clap like a man. That's Amen. Right. They clap. That's it, Bob. My Lord. Listen. That's Amen. <laughs> If the spirit of God get in a man, Go ahead. God will make you humble. That's right. But not that humble. That's right. That's right, bro. Amen. When a woman preach, she's in sin. That's right. When a preacher ordain you, yes, he's putting sins yes. upon you. Amen. You are breaking divine law. Oh, yes. License don't make a preacher. No. It's like you got some men that got a heavyweight title around their waist. You think it's a fluke. That's right. Because they can't fight a bit. That's right. That's right. Listen. And women rule over them. Women rule over them. The prophet said what? Oh, my people. It grieved them. Amen. Um, now, if you got the same spirit in you that's in them, right. then you will be grieved. Yes, that's right. Oh, yeah. 
The Bible says you're baptized by one spirit into one body. God is one spirit. That's right. So the same spirit that affects the former brothers. That's right. Why don't it affect the churches today? Amen. Why aren't the Baptists and the so-called apostolic and the Pentecostal and the non-denomination who affect it? That's right. If they had the same spirit in them right. that the prophets and the apostles had, you wouldn't have a bishop in America Go ahead. laying hands on a woman ordaining her for a preacher. That's right. You wouldn't have one in America. That's right. That's, That's right. Not one. But these church-going, money-hustling, Cadillac-driving, cross-wearing devils right. Amen. that pose as your preacher, That's right. that pose as your pastor. That's right. I don't care if it's your daddy. Amen. If your mama is a woman preacher and your daddy allow it and he's a preacher, then you are the son of a false prophet. That's, That's right. right. That's right. That's right. Are you listen to the old troublemaker? Go ahead. Amen. What did he say? And women rule over them. Women. Women rule over them. Rule over them. Oh, my people. Oh my, I feel the same way. Same way, that's right. I'm grieved by it. That's right. I'm sorry for them. That's right. Amen. Because then you start seeing a congregation of tiptoeing men. That's right. That's true. Walking like women. <laughs> Bobbing his head. That's it. That's right. That's it, Bob. Make a place. Is that right? That's right. That's it. Glory to God. Hold my people, they which lead thee, cause thee to error. And destroy the way of thy path. All right, some folks say, well, that's the Old Testament. We ain't living by that no more. Let's get some grace. All right, Amen. we'll give you some grace. First Corinthians chapter 14. First Corinthians chapter 14. Follow me in your Bible. That way you don't think I'm making this stuff up. Because a lot of folks get upset with me and say, well, you women can preach at Pastor Jennings Church. I don't have no church. That's right. Jesus said, upon this rock, I'll build my church. My church. Right. I don't have no church. That's I didn't right. die for no church. I'm not building no church. That's Go right. ahead. I'm one of the workers in the church. That's, That's right. right. The head of the church is Christ. That's, That's right. right. He hired me, Amen. and I'm on a job too, Amen. brother. Go ahead. Amen. And I'm working for it. Go ahead. Amen. You understand? Amen. Listen. First Corinthians chapter 14. What is it? And at verse 33. Yes. For God is not the author of confusion. God is not the author of confusion. But of peace. But of peace. As in all churches as of the saints. As in all the churches of the saints. Let your women keep silence in the churches. Let your women preach in the churches. Let your women keep silence in the churches. Let them preach in the churches. Let your women keep silence in the churches. Mm. Amen. Now you know what some false prophet said? <laughs> Paul mm. was having trouble. Mm. That's out right. the women in the Corinthian church mm -hmm. right mm -hmm. and to keep them in check uh -huh. he wrote that letter to them mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. well the Bible said what I say the one I say to all I say the all That's mm -hmm. right. now let us itemize and give an understanding what it means when it says be silent in the church silence. That's right. it isn't talking about praying no because no. the scripture teaches us all to pray. That's right. <clears throat> Hannah prayed, mm -hmm. and Eli thought she was drunk. That's right. It isn't talking about singing. Mm -hmm. Deborah sung. Amen. And the scripture teaches us come before his presence with singing. That's right. Certainly isn't talking about prophesying. No. Because Anna the prophetess prophesied. That's, That's right. That's right. So now we got to find out what is it talking about. Right. Amen. Listen. Let your women keep silence in the churches. What? For it is not permitted unto them to speak. You hear that? It is not permitted. Women are not allowed to have a speaking engagement. That's right. Oh, That's right. You find these churches and these DJs over the radio mm -hmm. announcing mm -hmm. Bishop Mother So-and-so. Right. Uh -huh. Or mother so-and-so, the first lady of the church, going to give the sermon? That's right. It is no first ladies in God's church. That's no. Right. Listen, you that go to these churches where the preacher wife gets special privileges, mm -hmm. get out of that place. That's Amen. Right. Who she think she is? That's, That's right. right. That's right. That's right, sir. That's right. If you got to obey God, she got to obey God. That's Amen. That's right. If you got to sit on hard pews, she got to sit on them. That's right. Who is she? That's right. That's right. Amen. But in these false churches, a lot of times the preacher wife, she boss. Oh, yeah. Even the men got the answer to her. That's Amen. Right. Oh, yeah. She want to be in the spotlight. That's that's right. Right. Man, I'm glad I ain't got no wife like that, man. Oh, Amen. No, you come, you come to the temple, oh, yeah. you wouldn't even know who my wife is unless someone tell you. That's right. But a lot of these preachers, why I want you, want you to make sure that's it right. gets as loud as a chicken. Amen. That's right. Sir. That's right, sir. <laughs> want you to know, yeah, I'm the one. I'm that's the one. Right, sir. Loud, ruthless, bitter, untamed, that's and right. disrespectful. That's right. right. God, women have a meek, quiet spirit, discipline. That's right. Amen. Holy women. Mm -hmm. 
not loud and foolish and barbaric. Mm -hmm. Our women are taught. That's right. Our women are taught how to conduct themselves in the street, on the job, anywhere in public. Yes, Amen. Right. We're not so caught up in the Bible that we're going to be yelling up and down the street, praise the Lord. What? Praise the Lord. What you said? Praise the Lord. <laughs> Wait till you get to the person. That's right. Amen. Then greet them in a proper manner. That's right. It is written, let all things be done decently. And in order. And in order. That's Amen. Right. What may seem right to us don't make it right in the eyes of God. That's, That's true. Right. Listen. Let your women keep silence in the church. Why? For it is not permitted unto them to speak. What are you doing with a speaking engagement? Amen. What are you doing calling yourself a little preacher? That's right. Somebody said, well, what about the scripture where the woman ministered to Jesus? Jesus. Who in the world going to preach to Jesus? That's, That's right. right. That's right. That's right. Preach to the Messiah? That's right. That's right. Amen. That's something. Jesus said, mm -hmm. I didn't come mm -hmm. to be ministered to, but I come to minister. What you mean? I didn't come so you can teach me. That's right. So obviously it didn't mean she taught him. That's no. Right. The word minister simply means sir. to serve. Sir. That's right. That's all it means. She served him. Amen. That's what Paul meant when he said, help those women that labor with me in the gospel. I have a lot of women that work with me in the gospel, but none are preachers. That's right. That's right. They are ministers as servants as Phoebe was. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. The church accountant is a minister. Amen. But she's not a preacher. Not a preacher. That's right. My secretaries, many of those sisters, they're ministers. That's right. But they're not preachers. Why? They are servants. Servants. That's right. That's all it means. That's it. Just like me, I'm a minister, but I'm a servant. I serve truth. That's right. And this is our restaurant. That's right. Amen. Your menu is the scriptures. That's right. The difference is you can't come here and tell me what you want to eat. That's right. The grub is already prepared. Amen. Yeah. Amen. Right. God. You understand? That's right. It's already prepared. That's right. Glory to God. Amen. Come on, son. Let your women keep silence in the church. Let your women keep. This is, this, listen, brothers and sisters, especially. This is not. This has nothing to do with male chauvinism. Oh, no. no. So I don't want you to think this is male chauvinism. That's right. No, this is divine law. That's right. This is God's order. This order comes from heaven. Amen. That's right. God ain't never set up religion for it to go any type of way. No, no. God ain't never. No, no. Had a woman preach it? No way in the book. No way. Never. Never. A woman preach it? Even the nation of Islam. It's starting to resort to the same filth. My Lord. Right. The religion of Islam, Orthodox Islam, don't believe in women being imams. Mm -hmm. But the nation of Islam got their first mm -hmm. woman minister. My Lord. Proud about it. Mm -hmm. Proud. Why brag about a lie? That's right. It is not justified in nobody's religion. That's Amen. Right. Listen. Let your women keep silence and remember, in the churches. Don't get upset with me now. That's right. That's right. It's in the Bible that you have. In the Bible. Mm -hmm. Give chapter and verse. First Corinthians chapter 14 and verse 34. Give chapter and verse again. First Corinthians chapter 14 and verse 34. Listen. Let your women keep silence in the church. Why? For it is not permitted unto them to speak. And? But they are commanded to be under obedience as also saith the law. What if they want to know something? And if they will learn anything... Let the master husbands at home. How do the Lord feel about women speakers? For it is a shame. What? It is a shame. For oh, women. What? It is a shame. Why you don't have no shame? That's right. Why your little reverend don't have no shame? That's right. Why the woman that's up here don't have no shame? Uh -huh. Amen. How is it, Deacon? How you sitting in Sunday school being taught by a woman. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. How is that? The Bible tells the deacon, you must be apt to teach. That's right. But you sitting down, deacon, being taught by a deaconess. That's right. That's right. How backward have the churches that? become? Amen. And then out of ignorance, they refer to Adam and Eve because the woman was taken from the side of the man. Right. And they say that means that they are side by side. That's right. <laughs> My Lord. Again, one of those homemade scriptures. That's right. They just put something together and made it scripture. Mm -hmm. That's right. Yes, my wife and I are side by side. Mm -hmm. But when it comes to the gospel, Amen. it's God, me, then her. That's right. So I'm saying, huh, my husband ain't going to tell me that. All right, let's go to what God said. That's right. First Corinthians chapter 11. That's First Corinthians let's chapter see, is 11. it God, man, then the woman? That's, That's right. right. Huh? That's right. God, I say, I say God. That's right. Man, then the woman. Go ahead. It is not God, the woman, then the man. No, no. It is God, the man, and then the woman. So to my men that may be scared to say something because you think your baby going to turn to Antarctica. That's right. Go ahead. That's right. Go ahead. Open up your mouth. That's right. That's right. You think your bed going to get cold. Amen. 
and you too weak to endure a cold bed. That's right. That's right. And you will compromise God, Lord, and keep your bed warm. That's Amen. Right. Go ahead. That's a pitiful man. That's right. A man of God will stand on God's word if ice build up on his mustache. That's right. That's right. Speak the word. That's right. That's right. Speak the word. Speak the word. Freezes. What's wrong with you? My wife turned on me. That's right. That's right. Cold man. Amen. But you stick to this. That's right. That's right, sir. That's true. Are oh, you listening to the old man? Yes, That's right. That's Listen at the book. First Corinthians chapter 11 at verse 3. Follow me. But I would have you know. I want you to know. That the head of every the man. head of every man. Is Christ. Is Christ. And the head of the woman. The head of the woman. Is the man. What's wrong with the men today? That's right. That's right. It's hard to even find a man <laughs> worth marrying. That's right. Amen. That's something. They don't mind making a baby, but they don't want to take care of them. That's right. Amen. Go ahead. Go ahead. Amen. Yeah, here it is. Mm -hmm. He's an assistant pastor mm -hmm. to his wife. To his wife. That's right. Amen. She's running around kicking her legs all up in the air. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's right. Well, man, I'll be disgusted. That's mm -hmm. right. My wife yelling, supposed to be preaching, kicking her legs all up in the air. That's right. Coming all out of her clothes, my son, she's in the spirit. Mm -hmm. That's it right. ain't that much spirit. No, no. no. That's right. No, Scripture no. teaches us the spirit don't behave itself unseemly. unseemly. That's right. That means God don't conduct himself in a wrongful manner. No, That's right. That's right. When you find these preachers supposed to be so anointed and supposed to be so used of God, mm -hmm. they come from off the pulpit, mm -hmm. from behind a podium, sitting on people's laps, oh, yeah. supposed to be preaching, get that lustful devil off you. That's, That's right. right. That's right, sir. Amen. That's unseemly, unseemly. behavior. That's right. Sitting down on men and sitting down on women, rocking. That's right. That's Amen. unseemly. That's right. Unseemly. That's right. Move your legs. Let them rock on the floor. That's, That's right. right. That's right, sir. That's right. That's right. Amen. Amen. Listen. But I would have you know. I want you to know that the head of every man is Christ. This is not male chauvinism. No. This is divine law. That's, That's right. Beautiful. And Satan has sought to corrupt divine law. Mm -hmm. And what is the best way to corrupt divine law? Go to a divine book mm -hmm. and give misunderstanding of scripture text. That's, That's right. right. And then misrepresent the scriptures so the ignorant mm -hmm. don't know no better. They just say, well, yeah, he read from the Bible, but they didn't interpret it right. That's Amen. Right. They corrupt truth. That's right. Amen. That's right. All right, let's get some more letters here. I, I thought I would be done by now, but go ahead, sir. <laughs> Praise the Lord. God bless you. Yeah. I've seen a number of your programs from yourself, and believe me, I praise God that there is a, a, a beacon for the masses today for truth. Uh -huh. You do not see many people proclaiming holiness, period. Yeah, you hardly see anyone claiming it. Amen. Uh -huh. To see the women with their head coverings, shame facing and subjections, a true light of not only what is written, written requirement, but also what is, should be done willingly. Yeah. The brothers also are upright and disciplined. That is not seen in today's so-called Christian churches. My question is for the pro proclamation that Jesus is God. Yes. Now a debate or now now a debate your teachers. This is not what I have seen or others attempt to challenge you scripturally, but to get an understanding as to as Paul has stated mm -hmm. a more excellent way. The person is asking about the Godhead. Number All one, right. in Saint John one and one, it states that in the beginning was the Word. Mm -hmm. The Word was with God, and yes. the Word was God. Yeah. The same was in the beginning with God, as denoted by the coloration. In their email, it states that Jesus was God, not is God. Jesus, this person says, is not God. Matthew 6 and 9, after this manner, therefore, pray we, pray ye, our Father which art in heaven. All right. Hallowed be thy name. All right. He taught them to pray to the Father and not to himself. All right, let's break this down. Amen. Mm -hmm. Let's pick up every scripture they have. In St. John chapter let's 1. Get all the scriptures on the table and put truth right in the corner pocket. That's Amen. Right. Jesus Christ is God, was God. Going to be God, mm -hmm. Amen. but not that man. That's, That's right. right. That's it. Did you hear me? That's Amen. right. Amen. Let's break it down and take it apart because he has been misrepresented for years. Mm -hmm. A lot of folks teach Jesus Christ as God, but they don't know how to teach it correctly. That's right. They teach that Mary birthed God. God don't have no mother. No, no. That's right. God ain't never had a mother. That's right. You can't associate none with God. That's right. Amen. God have no mother. Mm -hmm. God have no brother. That's right, sir. God has no sister. That's right. God is not begotten. That's right. God is not 
plural. Amen. God right. is one. That's Amen. right. God is not created. That's right. But God is the source of all creation. That's Amen. Right. God is not born. That's Go ahead. God always was. Amen. God is not human. That's right. God never was human. Amen. Neither did God become human. That's, That's it. Right. God can die. That's right. Amen. Wonderful. That's it, Bob. That's Wonderful. It. Yes. Amen. Are you listening? That's Amen. right. Thor said, well, how can you say Jesus is God then? Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Let's go to work. That's Amen. Right. That's right. Listen, that's now. right. Listen. And learn. That's, that's right. right. For if you look at the man, Christ Jesus, the Messiah, and say, oh, that man was God. Mm -hmm. Well, God said, I'm not God a man. Is not that's a man. Right. That's God right. Is that's God right. is not a man. Now, the Bible is a book of mystery. That's what it is, sir. That's, that's right. And if you're not divinely inspired and can't analyze the mystery of the book, you will think the book contradicts itself. That's Amen. Right. But the book don't contradict oh, it itself. The problem is the same spirit that caused the book to be written must be in the minister to analyze what is written. That's right. That's right. Why do you think I keep saying a school don't make preachers? That's Amen. Right. The same right. God that made Paul must make a man when he stand behind That's here. Right, That's, That's right. right. Then that man can read Paul and say, I understand. That's right. Huh? That's right. Now, listen. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. We had to be redeemed, mean connected, mm -hmm. or brought back. Two. Time, That's right. God divine, mm -hmm. God spirit, uh -huh. God eternal, uh -huh. God everlasting. Mm -hmm. Well, where did God come from? The Bible says from, from everlasting. Everlasting, everlasting to everlasting. everlasting. Thou art God. So he came from, everlasting. from, everlasting. from where there is no beginning. That's right. And he's traveling mm -hmm. to where there is no end. No end. That's right. What you mean he always was? That's, That's right. right. And always will be. That's right. That's it, sir. That's God. That's God. God. Mm -hmm. Wonderful. When Adam, Beautiful. who was the first one to bear the title Son of God. That's right. Jesus was not the first one called Son of God. That's, That's right. right. Adam was the first one called Son of God. In Luke chapter 3. Listen. And at verse 38. Listen. Which was the son of Enos. Which was the son of Enos. Which was the son of Seth. The son of Seth. Uh -huh. Which was the son of Adam. Which was the son of Adam. Which was the son of God. Amen. That's right, sir. Amen. Son of God. Amen. Now, why was Adam called Son of God? Son of God. Amen. You just said God don't have no children. <laughs> That's right. Sir. Son mm -hmm. means servant. servant. That's mm -hmm. right. He was the Son of God, servant of God, because he was created in God's image. That's right. God will use an image mm -hmm. similar to Adam's image Go ahead, for the purpose of redemption. That's right. So by one man, sin made his introduction into the world. That's right. That's right. That's right. And man fell short of the glory of God. That's all we had get there. Right. Mm -hmm. And after man erred and came short of the glory of God, man had to be redeemed. That's right. But until redemption come, mm -hmm. God kept sending prophets. That's right. Kept sending warners. Mm -hmm. To warn the people about their wickedness. Oh, they went through old carnal rituals. Amen. Offering up lambs and bullocks and heifers and turtle doves and trying to get rid of their sins. Aaron, the high priest. Mm -hmm. And then there was of the tribe of Levi, the sons of Aaron, Ithamar, Eleazar, Nadab, and Abihu. Mm -hmm. yes, the high priest had a commandment to get an escaped goat. That's right. 
and take his hands and lay upon the head of the goat. Of the goat. Right. Then make confession. Mm -hmm. Admit the sins of the people and his wrong. And confess right. upon the head of the goat. That's right. And after the sins was laid upon the head of the goat, a qualified man or a fit man will come. That's right. And lead the goat away, which was symbolic to the carrying away of the sins of the people. That's right. But yet the people's sins were not carried away. So the scripture says heaven was searched, mm -hmm. earth was searched, and God looked underneath the earth that was searched and couldn't find no man worthy mm -hmm. to open the book and then loose the seven seals thereof, meaning God couldn't find no man worthy to come to fulfill, to open the book, meaning to explain the book. That's right. That's right. See, when the book is open, it is still closed. Mm -hmm. To them that not understand the writing of it. That's right. It's still sealed. Mm -hmm. Jesus come and plainly said, I come to fulfill That's right. the law. The law. So the Catholics say, Hail Mary, the mother of God. Wrong. Wrong. That's right. God ain't got no mama. No, no. God is higher than heaven, deeper than hell, broader than the sea, and longer than the earth. Without father. Listen. In Hebrews chapter 7 and at verse 3. The scripture teaches us. Without father. Talking about God. That's right. Without father. Without mother. No mother. Without descent. No descent. Having neither beginning of days. Having no beginning. Nor end of life. And have no ending. That's right. Jesus, the son of God, or the servant of God, or the savior, or the sacrifice of God. Amen. Was created... In the body of a woman. Mm -hmm. That's why he was called second Adam. Look at what him and Adam had in common. That's right. Adam was created from the dust of the earth. Right. Jesus was created from the dust of the earth. That's right. Adam had no earthly father. Mm -hmm. Jesus had no earthly father. Mm -hmm. Adam's father was God. God. Jesus' father was God. That's right. Some say Adam was a prophet. That's wrong. Mm -hmm. Why would Adam be a prophet and no one in the world to prophesy to? Amen. <laughs> That's right. If you a prophet, there got to be someone to prophesy to. That's right. No, Adam was not a prophet. No. He the only man living. <laughs> what are you going to prophesy to? Animals oh, and trees? Amen. No. Jesus, it is said that God became man. That's right. Let's get the language of that. That's right. Let's first see what nature does God have. In St. John chapter 4 and at verse 24. Listen. God is a spirit. God is a spirit. A spirit. A spirit. Mm -hmm. God is divine. Mm -hmm. God is eternal. That's right. God is everlasting. That's right. The Bible says in the beginning was the word and the word was with God. So right then a Trinitarian mm -hmm. would think there's another God standing next to the Almighty. That's right. Because it is the term is used with, with, with God. God. Mm -hmm. In the beginning was the word and the word is with God. Well, if a man or a woman say a thing. And they are known to be a man of their word. That's right. Their word is with them. That's right. Meaning their word is of them. That's right. When the Bible said the word is with God, that means God is a God of his word. Amen. When he speak, it happens. That's right. Let there be light. Here come light. That's right. That's it. Someone said, well, wait a minute. What about when he said, let us. Let us make man. Make man. That's right. Now, if it was one by himself, why would he say, let us. Us. Make man in our, our image after our likeness. Right. If it's just one. Who was he talking to, Mr. Know-it-all? Amen. That's right. That's right. To talk means to counsel. Go ahead. Who was he counseling with? Mm -hmm. Himself. In Ephesians so I said, oh, don't tell me God is talking to himself now. Let's get some book. In Ephesians chapter 1 and at verse 11. Everything God do, he counseled with himself first. That's right. <laughs> That's right. Uh -huh. Amen. When he said, let there be light, who was he talking to? That's right. That's true. When he said, let there be a firmament in the midst of, his, of the deep. That's right. Who was he talking to? That's right. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Who was he talking to? Go ahead. 
Go ahead. Go ahead. Let there be beasts in the field, fowls in the air. Oh, who was he? Who was around? Amen. Torn said, well, the angels was there. The Bible said he created the host of heaven. That's right. So the angels didn't always exist. That's right. So who was he talking to? Who was he talking to? Well, he hadn't been talking to another God. He said, before me, there was no God formed. Neither shall there be after me. Now tell me who he's talking to. Go ahead. He said, there is no God with me. And besides me, there is no God. And I know not any. Now who was he talking to? Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Who was he talking to? Go ahead. When God speak. Preach it, man. Preach it. And that which now exists come into being. Amen. He does it by giving self consolation. That's right. What you mean? He expressed himself. Why you think the scripture says that the spirit speaketh expressly. That's right. Expressly have a twofold meaning. Mm -hmm. You know, when you got to get on an express train. Mm -hmm. It's very quick going right to one stop. That's right. Amen. Then we use the word to express, mean to make known, to talk, to say something. That's right. Mm -hmm. So when God said, let us make man, he was expressing himself. That's right. And man expressly came out the earth. Words formed right. man. Go ahead. Go ahead. That's why God bid a title. Word. Word. That's right. In the beginning, the word was with God and the word was God. Word means speech. Speech means language. You got to use language to bring that which never exists into being. That's right. Go ahead. Go ahead. So man wasn't here. Word spoke. Preach it. Preach it. Let us, Let us make man. Go what ahead. happened to the earth? Words form the fashion. Go ahead. Go ahead. Form the image. Amen. How did he get here? Words Word. brought him here. That's right. That's right. Glory to God. That's right. Listen who he was talking to. In Ephesians chapter 1 and at verse 11. Oh, this is good, man. Amen. Listen. Ephesians chapter 1 and verse 11. Ephesians chapter 1 and verse 11. In whom also we have obtained an inheritance. We have obtained an inheritance. Being predestinated according to the purpose being of Being predestinated him. or foreordained according to the purpose of him. Who the purpose of God. That's right. Who worketh all things. Worketh. Worketh. All things. After the counsel. After the counsel of, of his, his own, own will. will. Amen. He counsel within himself. His own will. That's right. Let us make man. Go ahead. I want something else here that will reflect me. That's right. Who hath directed? In Isaiah 40 and verse 13. Do you listen? Who hath directed? Who hath directed? The spirit of the Lord. God directs himself. That's right. He's the self-existing one. That's right. He directs himself. He guides himself. That's right. Now who can direct him? Who hath directed the spirit of the Lord? Who direct the spirit of the Lord? Or being his counselor, hath taught him. That's right. God need no counsel. With whom took he counsel? With he, with whom Amen. did God counsel with? And who And yet him? he said, let us make man. Who is he counseling with? That's right. Who is it? That's right. He is the counselor. That's right. The mighty God, mm -hmm. the everlasting Father, Go ahead. and the Prince of Peace. That's right. Of the increase of his government and peace, there shall be no end. Right. He don't need no advice. No, no. And who instructed him? Who instruct him? And taught him. And and Amen. taught him in the path of judgment. In the path of judgment. And taught him now. See, when he made man, he used judgment. That's right. Because nothing that he made in the earth can reflect him like man could. That's right. So when he made man, he used judgment because he will put his will in man, and only man will be able to carry a message right. to a people. Go ahead. Amen. Go ahead. Are you listening? That's right. Amen. Wonderful. So in order for man to be redeemed or be connected to God, Amen. man was separate from God. That's right. What separate Jersey from Philadelphia? Water. Water. Mm -hmm. What connect Jersey to Philadelphia? A bridge. bridge. That's right. The bridge is the mediator. That's right. It's between. between. Amen. Jersey and Philly. Mm -hmm. That's right. And so folk don't drown by being fool enough trying to drive in water. That's right. 